I'm an idiot. <sighs> Welcome back, Soma, everyone. I am an idiot. Two, bottom right. Two, five, zero, one. It's a one. I thought it looked like freaking... Here's the problem here. Why, why I have a hard time seeing that as a one. I've taken math classes up through calculus, so rudimentary understanding of mathematics. And I do mean rudimentary. Aaron has a, a degree in mathematics. Math goes way farther than calculus. So I have a rudimentary understanding of mathematics. Now, I have, I have the tools I need to, to do math. Once you get into calculus and slightly beyond calculus, you use Greek for a lot of things. The one, the zero one right there, specifically the one with the little slash, that looks like a Greek letter. Looks like a freaking Greek letter. I'm an idiot. Freaking door. Wow. Seriously. Can I leave now? <laughs> it's permanently unlocked. I guess it unlocks from this side. Wait. Wait, wait, wait. Well, that's a really crappy security system. You unlock it once and it's unlocked forever. Oh yeah, I had cups on the ground. <laughs> I had forgotten. Here, let's just... Alright. I have that picture as one of my several desktop backgrounds. It's really cool. 361. Monday, James G. 9 to 12. Alright. But I want to open it. I want to open it. Oh. Okay. Fine. What about first aid? No? Okay. U.S. National Oceanic and Atmospheric Administration. That's cool. That's probably a real picture. I imagine both... Well, I know the Ant Nebula is a real picture. This is probably a real picture, too. Antarctica? Maybe. That's cool, though. Is that the room I need to be in? Steve! All day. Actually, I don't think that is the room I need to be in. All right. Pace Laboratories. If only I had a higher definition, like a much larger monitor, I could read this. But I think everything is maxed out. Yeah, high. Rendering, high. I don't think texture. Oh, texture could go higher. I don't know if that matters. We'll try that. I don't think it'll matter though. Yeah, sure. No, and that doesn't really help. Like at all. Average test results. Why, wait, hang on, what? Wait, so the one that the, the, the little white dots on that is TCP-126. Then is that void? Because if that's void, and that's void, that pie chart makes no sense. I'm, I'm up to you, pie chart. I'm up to your game. Suspicious pie chart. I'm doing shady science here. I don't know if we need to be sticking around. We're doing real shady science here. If they got a pie chart with two void sections on it, and only one void color. Suspicious. 
P Pass Joint Ventures. Okay. Market projections. Ah, that's what those are. Got it. Transformation rates. Development phase. Marketing release. Polish beta alpha press overview. And then main. Boy, C got everything except for marketing. Jeez. Uh, hardware from Haimatsu. Acquisition principles. Overview tech co-op. Venture overview. Okay. And yes, we're still delaying the scary part of the game, which is like 90% of the game. We gotta explore all the things while we have the chance. New laboratories. Huh. Conversions. Future development. Ha! That's creepy. What's in here? A dark room. Lots of servers. Is there a light? Yeah, there is. Don't have to be a dark, scary room. We're good. We're good. Alright. Wait. No, I didn't see anything. Okay. The nervous system. Well, I mean, it, it's more complicated than that, but... Okay. I mean, if you want to break it down that simply, sure. Sure, we can go with that. What are you doing over here? Why are you leaving all this stuff out? It's dangerous. I've been a computer technician before. That's dangerous. Don't, don't do that. <laughs> it's dangerous for the equipment. It's dangerous for anyone who wanders by. Like, that's a safety hazard right there. What is this? Whole bunch of brain scans. Oh, and they have, uh, looks like serotonin on there. They got neurons. MRIs. You got a real close-up of the spine right there. That's interesting on the right side. Uh, the, uh, oh, what's the thing? The bottom left, it goes from A to N. Uh, it's electro, is it electromagnetic imaging? No. No, no, no. It measures the, measures brainwave activity. I forget what it's called. I should know this. I have a psychology degree. That's like part of knowing that. It's understanding all this neuroscience stuff. At least my degree was. <laughs> um, anyways, that, that's cool. We have a 3D brain. Kind of a weird looking brain, but sure. Jaws. Heh, <laughs> I get it. Jaws. Soma. Happens underwater. Jaws. Nice. Toronto Daily. What is this? That's suspicious. We'll just we'll just leave that there. That's suspicious. You got more of them. That's another flash drive. What is with all these flash drives? What do we do with them? There's so many flash drives. What's this? Oh. Oh, it's uh, for a camera. Probably the brain camera. That would make sense. There's a... Is that... That's a cable. This world is weird, man. Got things phasing through other things. Ah, uh, I bet... I, I bet these are brain scans. That's what I would guess. Those are brain scans. Okay. Oh. What's this? Uh, doesn't matter. I can't grab it. Alright. I guess we're done in here. Aside from this madness. More things that I can't read. They put a lot of detail in this game. That otherwise is unaccessible. So, I don't think I missed, wait, 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 well, that's right, I wanted to see what this was. Huh. There, I saw Munchie. There you go, we'll give this to Munchie. What's up, dude? Oh, jeez. Oh, <laughs> didn't hear you come in. 
Simon Jarrett, right? Dr. Munchie? Well, it's uh, just Mr. Munchie, but I'm working on it. <laughs> Actually, you're helping me right now. Is this part of your thesis work? Yeah, it's a study I'm doing with my colleague, Paul Berg. We hope to design a gentle way to work with brain reconstruction to help people like you. Oh, did you uh, take the tracer fluid? Yes, yes I did. Great, well we can start whenever you're ready. I took the tracer fluid several hours ago because I, I spent a long time out there in the waiting room. So it might not be super effective anymore. Just letting you know, I might need more tracer fluid. Just saying. Wait, 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 I could read that. Something home, oh. Notice. Please, have a seat. Notice home ISP provider called about being taken down because lacking payments. Huh. Just have a seat and we'll be out of here in no time. Yeah, this is a shady operation. This is like beyond a shady operation. <laughs> I don't really want to sit down and take a seat, man. This is a really messed up a situation you got here. I guess I do have to sit down. Oh. Come on, let's do this. Please don't touch anything. <laughs> Just sit down and we'll get started. Oh, but I want to touch all the things. So, what exactly are we doing? We're going to do a scan of your brain. Then we build a computer model of it and bombard it with stimuli. The program will help us to quickly iterate your treatment plan until it's fully optimized. In short, develop the perfect treatment for your condition. So it's not just a study, this will actually help me. Oh, I should hope so, otherwise this would be a huge waste of time. <laughs> you know I have a serious condition, right? You heard about the car crash, the X months to live deal? Yes, I heard. Must be hard having to hear that. As you know, it's because your brain is weakened so much that it can start to bleed every so often. And if it ever gets real bad, it will kill me. Well, we probably can't restore your brain completely, but we should be able to make those X months turn into years, decades even. And if you take care of yourself and don't do anything too crazy, we should be able to get you to outlive the best of us. That's the hope. I really hope you're right about this. Me too. This could make a huge difference for how we treat people with brain damage. So, what do you say? Should we get going? Sure. Let's get started. Take a seat. Alright. Literally, that's all that's left is to sit. I've even played with stuff. Hey, he won't, he won't be mad at me anymore. That's too bad. Alright. One last time. Please, have a seat. You're running a shady operation. Let's get this show on the road. Fine. If you're running a shady business, sir. I don't trust you. Weird. We have blue shoes. Interesting. All right. That sounds fun. Oh. All right. Let me just get this out of the oh, way. Why? You are Simon Jarrett, correct? Right. Toronto, Canada, Munchie. Born 1988, July 16th. Right. Flat neurograph, version six. Good. All files in order. Will this hurt? It's just a scan. It'll hurt about as much as getting your picture taken. Indians thought cameras would steal their souls. Is that so? Well, let's hope they're wrong. <laughs> Ready? Say cheese. Cheese! Cream cheese? Well, here we go. Welcome to Soma. Took three episodes to get this far. Three episodes! God. We had so many problems finding such basic things. Hello? Mr. Munchie? Did something go wrong? Well, this isn't funny. Yeah, because in that short time frame, they could create. I'm not supposed to put myself in. They could create a horror situation. 
It's a different This is chair. kind of stressing me out. Yeah, I bet it is. Hey! Anyone? You maybe don't want to yell so much, sir. Is that a shoe? That is a boot. Huh. Whoa. Did I just, like, I felt like I teleported. What in the world is this stuff? Wait. I can't read that. Okay. That probably wasn't a smart thing to do, but, but this place looks pretty run down, so. Like I said, shady operation. Wait, 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 what does it say? What does it say? Oh. It's a battery. Derp. I was hoping it would say, like, what facility we were at or something. Be like that's Chinese. Zero five, zero six. We have one, two, three, and four. But five and six are gone. Okay. Might be important. Service console omni tool chip installer. Toolbox. Omni tool chip installer. Build, shape, and optimize your Omni tool with fully customized tools and assistance. Given this is so brightly colored, I imagine this will become relevant later. Like, out of everything, we have two things. We have a red light next to a window. So, you know, jump scare possible. And then we have this thing, which is super, super brightly colored. Okay. Well, we're going to stop here. We can continue on this way next time. We have finally started Soma. <laughs> it took three episodes. First episode, where's the fluid? Second episode, where's the code? <laughs> now we're finally here. Hopefully things will go a little bit more smoothly. But holy crap. It took three episodes to finally get to Soma. It's about time. Thanks for watching, everyone. Like, subscribe, share. Thanks to Amphit and, and Simon and for being Patreon supporters. I'll see you guys next time with more Soma. Oh. If there is one thing, one thing, this game has made me feel, it is stupid. This game has made me feel Stupid. There's, like, I'm, I'm not scared. I'm, I just, I, f I feel like an idiot. <laughs> it it should have all that, all the, the, the code, the liquid, that all should have been first episode, done, easy, no problem. It took three freaking episodes to find two things. I, if, if the rest of Soma goes this way, it won't be a scary game. It will just be a puzzle game. It'll be a puzzle game in the same way that The Legend of Grimrock 2 is a puzzle game. You just kind of wander around until you stumble across something. And it's like, hey, I found what I needed, but it took forever. But the, ob the solution was always obvious. You just were an idiot and you missed it the first time around because you overthought it or you couldn't read it or, you know, X, Y, Z thing. And it's like, ugh. So this level of puzzle reminds me of Legend of Grimrock. It's not hard. It's not. And that's why it makes you feel like an idiot when you have it done. Oh. Jeez. But now that we're finally in the game... We can enjoy it in the next episode. So, again, thanks for watching. I'll see you guys next time. One last comment. On the gamma being maxed out, it's because it needs to be maxed out. Otherwise, I can't see anything. My monitor is old and it's dying, and so I have to max out the gamma. So, it probably, it, it probably looks brighter on your guys' screens and possibly even on your phones than it does on my monitor. Which is a little frustrating, but 
Yay, it'll make it more fun. We're not in Toronto anymore. Thanks for watching. DFTBA.